G'day guys, Clint here from Quicksand Flooring. Today we've got a great project that we're doing. We're going to be cleaning and oiling an exterior table that we purchased on Facebook Marketplace. I was looking on there, found it for $100, uh, thought it was a good buy. It's a solid teak table. We're not gonna be doing any sanding. We're going to be using the Walker Exterior Wood Cleaner. And then we're gonna be moving on to the Walker Exterior Wood Oil. Similar tables, if you were to buy something like this brand new, you'd be looking two to $3,000 region. It's an extendable table, so you can open it up, the middle pops out. All right, some tips and some tricks for you if you are searching for furniture. You wanna be looking for solid timber. You don't really want a veneer. If you can get some sort of hardwood, an Australian hardwood, something structurally, it's, it's got its integrity. Uh, just cosmetically, it looks a bit rough. You also don't want something that's covered in 15 layers of paint or loads of old varnish because then you're gonna have to sand it back to raw and start again. Grade off timber or if the timber's a bit green and a bit moldy, this is all just surface damage and it can literally be washed away. Before we start this project, there are some items that you are gonna need to purchase. Uh, of course, we'll be going to our favorite hardware store in the world, Bunnings. The first things that you're gonna need is some good scrubbing brushes something that's easy to hold on to and something that you can really get stuck into and do some good hard scrubbing. And we've also got a broom style scrubbing brush. This is specifically a deck scrubbing brush. We're also going to need an applicator pad once we start applying the exterior oil plus a standard brush. I've just gone for a 63 mil brush for applying the product. Rags. A uh, bag of rags, uh, old t-shirts, anything like that you can use. Um, uh, Sabco um, pads. This one's a white polishing pad and we've got a green scrubbing pad. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to dismantle the table. The top pulls off and it's gonna be much easier to make our work surface on the ground because we're uh, not gonna clean this part by hand. We're going to use a floor polishing machine or a floor scrubbing machine and we're going to use a large brush on the bottom. It's just a quicker, easier way of doing it. You can also use a broom or a scrubbing brush. We'll do the exact same job but it's just gonna be a bit more elbow grease. Uh, the buffing machine just does it a lot quicker. Right, what I'm doing here is I'm just cleaning the table with a brush, getting rid of the big chunks of dirt, any loose bits. There's some leaves, there's some spiders. Wouldn't be Australia without some spiders in it. Uh, so we're just getting rid of all of that, getting it prepped and ready for the hosing down process and the cleaning process. So we're mixing up one litre of exterior wood cleaner to one litre of water. Our bottle is a two litre spray bottle, so it's a 50-50 ratio.
Gonna go in Look at what you can achieve without any sanding and just using high quality products like the Walker range we are showcasing in this video. These two products will be linked below to purchase from our online shop Quicksand Supplies. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one.